So Brittany Griner has been released from a Russian prison in exchange for a convicted arms dealer. That's interesting because there's a man sitting in a Russian prison somewhere by the name of Paul Whalen, a United States Marine, who apparently was convicted of spying and sentenced to 16 years in prison. And Brittany Griner was convicted of having vape cartridges in her luggage at an airport. And she received nine years. Now, I disagree with the sentence. I think it's ridiculous. But this just proves one thing about the Biden administration. They care about minorities and they care about transgender or LGBTQ people because after all, Brittany Griner is a black female and she's lesbian. They don't care about the United States Marine who served his country and was allegedly spying and convicted in a closed door trial that no one witnessed, no one had photos, no one had videos, no one knew anything. From what I've read in reports about this case, they're having photo ops with Griner's wife. She's on a plane, she's on her way home, and the cackling hen Carmela Harris is standing there with that ridiculous look on her face. And of course, Joe Biden had to reach out and get a feel. This is the administration that cares not about American people and American values. They care about things that mean nothing to the majority of Americans because the majority don't care about LGBTQ. Let these people do what they want. They don't care what color your skin is because they are not racist. But this administration is doing this for one thing. They're doing it for votes in elections to elect liberal Democrats to pass bad policy to destroy the United States more than it already is. They've proven time and time again that they do not care about the everyday average citizen. Now, I'm glad Brittany Griner got released. She shouldn't have got nine years, although she protested the national anthem at WNBA games. She shouldn't have been convicted. She shouldn't have been imprisoned. And now she's on her way home while the family of Paul Whelan sits and waits to see if he'll ever be released, to see if this administration will do anything to have him released. And they give back a convicted arms dealer to do what? To only deal arms again, to sell illegal arms to foreign countries. That's what's going to happen, in my opinion. So again, the Biden administration is a laughingstock. They're a disgrace, and they do not care about the everyday average American. They play politics. They play with different groups of people because we care so much, they say, when in reality, they do it for photo ops and for a couple of seconds on the news. They're a disgrace, and we can't wait till 2024 when this destructive administration is gone from Washington for good because they stand for nothing. They do not stand for the American people. They stand for themselves, for certain groups, and to fill their pockets with money. We all know this, and that's my opinion. Have a great day.